Hey guys, it's Teddy Tapper. My episode one for my freshwater tanks. And currently I have this 55 set up as just a planted community tank. And I plan on getting two more angels. And if you can see the little Corys right there, or the um, Rummy Nose right there, I'm going to get four more of those to equal ten. And then these guys, long no long... What do they call it? Long fin zebra dinos. I'm gonna get some more of those. And my Corys sitting on my rock. I'm gonna get like a couple more of those. There's two more right there. They're pretty lazy. And but the other fish I have in here, my they're called stenopomas. They're also known as uh what are they called? Climbing, spotted climbing perch or something like that. And there's one of them, and then the other one right there. And then these guys I just got today. I ordered two of them from Bob's Aquatics or something like that. I forgot what it's called. And I got three actually, but I only bought, paid for two, so they're pretty good. I mean, they came live and the only thing is the shells are a little messed up but the one of the other guys is up there and then the third one is back there right be right there you can barely see it right there anyways so the other inhabitants of this tank are let's see if I can find any. Um two auto three auto all autos the can't say it. One's right there on that. And then and then the last guy is you can see him, he's kinda glowing red right there. He's a Raphael catfish. And just Got a little uh, marine land cast or marine land cast filter and a big UV 15 watt sterilizer. Just runs in line, goes into the tank. This is a big 200 watt or yeah, 200 watt here and a refurbished JBJ light that's probably 10 20 years old. Yeah, anyways, it's my. Episode 1 of my freshwater tank has been up for two days, three days. But these fish used to be in that tank, which is now uninhabited. There's nothing in there. That's a rubber band that I need to get out. Yep. Okay. Bye-bye. Subscribe.